also have trashers. So, next day, sore than all hell. I even had to back out on Tic Tac because, uh, yeah, dude, I'm trashed. I threw my back out of the scrapyard. And then I just powered through the rest of it. But, trailer, empty. Uh, I'm actually about to post it for sale because my man that I bought this building from has another trailer. And I would rather have that trailer. So, I'm going to bounce that trailer and buy the his. But right, let's check this out. Now I can't take you inside because I didn't realize the door had a lock on it and when I pulled it to it locked the damn door. So now I gotta drill it out or bust it off. But here's here's what we're looking at. Bluers and all blue. I've gotta buy a roll-up door or two. But it should work. Thirteen hundred bucks, you can't really complain too much. I mean with a good pressure washing. That guy would look pretty good. Still got to put the trim on it. Might try to do that today. But the main focus of the day is to get around here and clean out, clean up, carport a little bit. I just put all my stuff back, the box truck and the trailer and all that. So that's one thing. I also need to cut grass, but hopefully it rains. So I don't have to. But if it does rain, I need to get in the building so I can see where it leaks. So I can tar that up. But I guess, boom. The plan will be all good to go. What's up, trashers? So I don't know if what I'm about to do is really smart or really stupid. But I thought I'd bring you along with it. Uh, looking for a tool. A tool of some sort. <coughs> about to start. What in the hell? I don't know if y'all could have heard that. I think it was a uh, rooster. I'm going to bring this pull bar. Um, so I'm going to go over here with the sawzall. Because I don't, I tried to drill, I put a drill through that door yesterday when I, when I found out it had a damn lock on it. And uh, yeah. It broke my drill. It's almost all the handle off. I was hoping that it breaks the connection and then I'm gonna take this pull bar and punch that whole door out. Hope. Hope that's what I can do because I don't want to ruin the door. I've got to fix the door just a little bit. But yeah, that's what we're gonna that's what we're gonna attempt. I still need to put the trimming on this door. I probably need to take a four four by four piece of wood or something put it at the foot of this door. We'll look at that later though. So yeah. This is the game plan. Maybe I'm supposed to turn that. Maybe that turned. Get some pliers, how about that? That might have worked. I hate that I ruined a perfectly good doorknob. I know you can't see it, but I cut the shit out of myself yesterday. When I went and picked that metal up for that building. And uh, I had that thing bandaged so tight. Now my finger looks like it's half dead. <clears throat> anyway, hopefully this works. I actually have a deadbolt that I'll uh, swap in place, so this ain't so bad. Alright, I'll see you over in a second. How oh, pliers didn't help. I'm gonna try to beat center that thing on this piece of rebar.
No way that damn bolt just lock is that strong. It's almost shot through the back, but Steven screws are still holding in the thing. It's got it loosening up, that's for sure. Should be able to drill them things out. Punch it up. <laughs> Perfect. All right, boys. Don't know how well you can really see in here, but girls in here I gotta either a I need to drop this frame down and put a board up there or B put a piece of wood down there don't know what y'all do yet we'll figure it out I do you think I'm gonna put my toolbox in here Got a few things I need to need to work on. Got to tar up some holes because my buddy took it apart, but he didn't necessarily mark everything <laughs> like he should have. So some things, some things are a little off. Some holes are missing, or some of the screws didn't line up. So we, I just made it work. So I've tar up a few things, but. Not bad, man. This looks a lot better in here anyway. All right, trashers. Garage is coming along. Still gotta clean up that side, but this side's looking pretty good. Um, <clears throat> just started looking at these tools right here that my man gave me yesterday. He gave them to me because these batteries won't stay charged, right? Well, I just looked up, there's a whole bunch of blades too. I just looked up this guy right here. This damn thing's going for $62. What? What? <laughs> That's just one tool. I'd imagine that probably goes for fifteen or twenty dollars. Um, that guy could go for just as much. That light could go for just as much. There's a uh, sawzall. Who knows? The drill is taped, so we know the drill has been well used. But still, I don't. I don't even care about the drill. Uh, awesome. <laughs> might might try to sell the box. What is that? There's two batteries right there. Sick. What's up, trashers? <clears throat> so, we're going to pull this trailer around front. Got a guy coming from an hour away to check it out. 
the way I look at it, if you're driving an hour, more than likely gonna buy it. <laughs> that's a long haul to say no. But, you know, I've been wrong. Um, that being said, he, uh, we haven't even talked about numbers. I've got a thousand bucks on it. I know I paid twelve hundred. Uh, Six hundred is my bottom dollar because this trailer has paid for itself over and over, and it needs new tires and it needs it needs a few things. So I'm, I understand that. So the way I see it, I've made my money out of it. If I get six hundred or over, then this guy's just paid for itself and made me a little bit more money. And besides, I'm taking whatever I get from it and buy my buddy's trailer for 1200 which when you guys see that trailer you'll understand why booyah look at that I don't know if you can even see it Wow! I love the backup camera but yeah that's what we're doing right now I'm gonna pull this guy around front don't mind the baby spit up <laughs> I might have Start cutting grass while I'm at it. Hopefully this guy buys it. I would like to be done with this trailer today. Uh, I got a couple packages we gotta pack up for mail tomorrow. And uh, yeah, other than that, there's no trash. I rode the streets earlier and there's like nothing. So I don't know what's up. I expect the people to be cleaning all their shit out. but. Apparently I'm the only one doing such. Anyway, see you guys in a little bit. All right, so the man said he's coming back in the morning. Though he did dicker with me a little bit, so maybe he really is coming back. I don't know. Here's what it is. Somebody will buy this thing. I'm not that worried about it. He uh, he's like, what's the best you'll do on it? He's like, I saw you got a thousand on it. I'm like, I know I got a thousand, but hey, what you thinking? He didn't want to. He didn't want to give me a prize. You can't blame him. I'm not a guy that will give a prize either. I'll let you shoot yourself in the foot. But I play this game, and I'm telling you, 600 bucks is kind of my bottom. So I was like, I don't know, man. I'll take seven for it. <laughs> Could have probably hit eight and did it, whatever. But I just, I just want this deal done. He's like, uh, 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 uh. You take six? I'm like, I'd do six for you. But he said the bank's closed today, which it is. It's Sunday. And he'd come back tomorrow, so... I guess we'll see. Just got the door, the lock, the deadbolt on the shop door handled and put a little little hook on there for a handle. I'll show you that later. But yeah, we'll see what's Alright Joshers, me and this little fella back out here in the junk cave. Can't wait to get cleaned up. Here's what we sold. Final Fantasy cases got fifteen bucks for those I think. And a Mass Effect coloring book got ten. That's including shipping. I think I sold it for like six bucks plus some change. So yeah, it's like ten bucks. Not big profits, but it's something. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video, whatever the hell we've done in this video, don't know. What are you doing? I don't know if I showed y'all, but check out the check out the port, man. Looking good. I think this table's coming in here. This is gonna go on my shop over there. I'm going to clean all that out and put my supplies. This is going in the shop over there. Toolbox will probably come over here. Because I, just, I was like, put toolbox in the shop. But this is like an empty carport that I can totally pull in here and work on stuff. So why wouldn't I leave my tools on this side? You know what I mean? Nah, me. Anyway, that's what we got going on. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Like, subscribe, and